This is Nuts and Bolts Speed Train with your keyboard shortcuts for your PowerPoint charts. And there are really just two of them. A shortcut for moving your charts around using your arrow keys and a shortcut for formatting the individual elements of your charts, both of which will make working with your charts a lot easier. And here in PowerPoint, let's first look at moving charts. And notice if I just select a chart and I try to use my arrow keys, this is what normally happens. You simply rotate between the different elements within your chart. So using my arrow keys alone, I cannot move the chart here in PowerPoint. So the trick is, or the shortcut, is to first hold the control key and then select your chart. Hold the control key, select the chart. And doing so selects the chart as any other normal object that I can then move around with the up, down, left, right arrow keys on my keyboard. Once you have the chart where you want it, you simply hit escape and you're now good to go with your chart. So that's moving a chart with your arrow keys here in PowerPoint. Now let's look at formatting the individual elements within your chart. And the trick to formatting the individual elements within your chart is you simply select the element that you want to format and then on your keyboard hit Control-1. Control-1 will pop open these format dialog boxes to the specific elements within the chart. So for example, if I close the dialog box and I want to format the axis, Control-1 will open up to the exact axis options for me to work with. If I close the dialog box again, Control-1, and there I am back with the series overlap and the gap width. Now with this window open, you can continue to select items within your chart, and sometimes it does rotate to the correct thing, but notice if I come again to the axis options, I'm not given the axis options, but if I hit control one, I quickly flip the dialog box back to those specific formatting elements. So that's how to quickly format the individual elements within your charts. So those are your two keyboard shortcuts for working with your charts. Number one, holding down the control key as you select a chart to select it as a normal object that you can then move around with your arrow keys. And number two, the control plus one keyboard shortcut to get the specific formatting options for your chart elements, which will cut down the time you spent hunting around for the correct formatting options. To grab a PDF of all of these awesome shortcuts plus over 100 more, look for the link beneath this video.